room, 4128. We're going to go in. Let's see what it looks like in here. All right, so this is a studio room. We got a kitchenette, so let's have a little microwave. Microwave, cabinets with some dishes. Dishes. Oh, oh, nice. Toaster, toaster and ice bucket. Ice. Got coffee, a coffee maker. maker. We got a little sink. Sink. Fridge. Fridge. Open it up wrong. Yeah. And nice the fridge, and then you get the trash barrel. Paper towel, trash barrel. Little, this is the seating area to sit down for two. So this is the bed. So it's queen size bed, it looks like. Yep. And then, oh, I love that picture. Oh, that's cool. Right. And then they get some plugs and uh, USB ports, some drawers. Yep, a couple USB ports. A couple of drawers. And it looks like. I don't know if you can tell. Try. Can you turn on that light, Meredith? Mm -hmm. By the bed so it dims, which is nice. Then if you hit the button, it shuts it off, which is cool. Here we get the sofa. End table. I think that end table opens up. Yeah, they have a back. Which is okay. nice. Yeah, we have one at home, so we know that it's backwards. <laughs> it's like a on TV tray. Yeah. And I think that opens up into the bed. Well, hopefully, because that's where the kids will be sleeping. And another end table with some USB ports. And then this is the entertainment center. The drawers, various sizes to put clothes in. Yeah, open the top one. I like the design, this is nice. Very, very clean. Nice big screen TV. The other. Bunch more USB ports. My wife was worried about that and I told her, no, don't under, worry. Under the bed is a very, um, it's very high clearance, you can put some pieces under there. Oh, yeah. yeah. And did you notice the, uh, before you go, do you see the mirror? Yeah, But that's nice, I, like, from a tree, you know, the uh, hollowed out a tree. And before, uh, we'll show you the bathroom. But then this is, our balcony. That's the pool. Uh, the pool. Pool view. Oh, look at this, Meredith. This view. Water view. Oh, yeah. This is beautiful. This is the quiet pool. And I think this is out. Uh, that's Boulder Ridge, if I correct about that. Wow, I love this. And you want to show us, show the bathroom? Yep. Well. So the bathroom has uh, this mirror that's barn door that slides open. And it has the vanity here so people can get ready here. With some storage space stuff. And then this is us as a sign door to the bathroom shower. And open it. So this is a door. I think it's just walk-in shower. Oh yeah. Walk-in shower is nice. Oh this one doesn't it. this doesn't have the um, Shampoo stuff. Oh, you get the rain. Rain shower. Shower there. Nice. And then for the quick. A little ledge for your stuff. This is nice. Yep. And then it's soap and shampoo. Mm -hmm. Oh, and I like this over the. The total pole the artwork. Very cool. And then we do have one closet here, right? Yep. Let me show the closet. Got the safe, got the ironing board, extra pillow and blanket. Yep. Hey, Marty, uh, you, did you realize this? Oh yeah, it pulls out. I guess you can put stuff put, there as put well. Put groceries there. Groceries. And there's a, also a can opener and Cut plastic cutlery. cutlery. And that's another trash. It's pretty nice. Yeah. So this will be our home for the next 10 days. And we'll, uh, we'll, we'll show you, during our 10 days, we'll show you around the resort to the pool and all the other amenities. So we're over at the fourth floor. And there's a little balcony area overlooking the lobby. 
and get a good view of everything from up here. So nice with all the totem poles. And if you look close here, you can see some animals etched out as well. Let's see if I can show them off here. And I think if you look over here, you'll see some more. such a beautiful place to stay. And there's all the seating in the lobby. So we are still on the fourth floor on the opposite end so uh, right below us is the front entrance to the lobby. Where we were earlier, we were right there on the last video shown. So we're just on the opposite end of the cutout. And you can see Whispering Canyon Cafe here. And if you look over here, what's good about this area is that there's some rocking chairs, but there's also a fireplace that you may not know about. So this is a nice little getaway area. And we're gonna go up one level from here and show you the view from there. Alright, so we're on the fifth floor, right above the front entrance to the lobby. And again, we're walking across, I would say this is like a balcony area. And here's some chairs you can sit in. Beautiful sunlight that can come in. And you don't have it running right now, but there is a fireplace that they will run here as well. Some nice designs on that. And again, just get you up higher to look at, look down on this beautiful lobby. And on this side, there is some more animals etched out over here that I'll sh show you. And if you look across here, there is a turkey there. If we go across here, get some over here, and you can see the nice designs on the lights over there. And you can see more etchings of the animals. I'm not sure what you call these like logs, totem poles. But, beautiful. So this is the fifth floor and you can see there's two more floors to go up. Uh, we may try to go up and see what it's like at the top if we can get up there. So we're gonna try that now. All right, so we're on the seventh floor now. And look at how we can see the whole totem pole. Oh, this is awesome. Now we're looking straight down on the entire lobby. See that's where we were earlier. Here we get a nice view of this totem pole up close. Nice designs. I think we're going to across that other area because I think this the kids area or something down there. We're gonna go see what that is. Alright. We're at the back of the lobby. And wanted to show you a couple of things. We have the uh, Territory Lounge here. And you have Irish Point. So first, there's the lounge. We've never tried the lounge. Um, we just go right up in here. All kinds of seating. This is probably full complimentary at the bar. Probably some finger food that you can get in here. So right up here is, it used to be Iris Point Dining, but it's now Storybook Dining. And you can just go right up this ramp here. And this is now a character dining with 
Where is it? Grumpy. Uh, Dopey. And uh, the Evil Queen. And I think Snow White's hair as well. So that's pretty cool. And there's a, a little waiting area here as well. Well, this part of the lounge area. And we're continuing down the ramp. So right up there was where Storybook Diamond is. So we're just walking down here to Roaring Fork, which is the quick surface area. But I'm going to pivot up here so you can maybe get a glimpse of what Park's Point was like or how they changed it for Storybook Diamond. We did try it back in December, we enjoyed it. Um, but we don't do character dinners too often. So we're going to continue. If you look out the windows here, this is the back of the lobby. So we're inside Lauren Fork. So here you get your chips, some gluten free snacks, which you can get some tips of ice creams. They do have the, the Mickey sandwiches bars and the ice cream bars. And, and wine. Wine. <laughs> Oh yeah, with, crackers. you go with the wine. <laughs> Fancy. So, you know, you get some cheese, fruit, water, and then your milks, different kinds of cups of fruit, sodas, parades, juices, and you get all kinds of different beers. This is the good stuff. This is the good stuff, the bakery. <laughs> so, those cupcakes look pretty good. Oh, that must be like a brownie or something in the shape of a Mickey. I'm assuming those are something you can decorate. I'm not sure what. Maybe. Oh, for the ice cream. I'll show you that. Croissants. Now that cinnamon roll looks really good. Some donuts. Cookies. Here you can get some soft serve ice cream. Looks like it's make your own for $4.99. This is the new uh, resort mug. Oh, uh, resort like mug, yeah. Mickey Mouse Club. It's all Mickey Mouse. Very cool. Oh, I nice. might have to get one of these. Yeah. Add it to a collection. And here's some of the food you can get here. Vegetarian pita. You get your tuna and turkey sandwiches. Well then a salad, Caesar salad. Now you get that brown mousse. Looks pretty good with that Mickey there. So, that looks yummy. And those are the specialty cupcakes I showed you over there. And I guess you order here and then you would pick up over here. Which is nice. And then there's some other snacks and stuff over here. And I'm sure the menu changes. This is probably the food for lunch and dinner. The Breakfast would be different. And then there is the big salad that I'm more recent salad that you've ever had.
to the quiet pool, you will find guys with Point Bar and Grill. If you look over here, you can come here, refill any mugs you may have, get coffee. And if you look right here, straight in the middle, this is the bar. And you can also, they also do have a menu here of things that you can order, if that's what you're interested in. Here's a better view of the bar. They do have a couple of TVs up there. I think it's a full-fledged bar. There we go. So this is a pretty cool place if you want to hang out while the kids or someone else is at the pool.